Are there any nominations for a special town meeting moderator? I'll nominate Jonathan Ramsey for moderator. Are there other nominations? Any other nominations? Any other nominations? Seeing none, all in favor of Jonathan Ramsey being special town meeting moderator, please say aye. 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 Motion passes. Aye. <laughs> Any uh, nominations for meeting clerk for this special town meeting? I'll make a motion that Susan Clerk, uh, Susan King be clerk at the meeting. Any other nominations? Any other nominations? Any other nominations? Seeing none, all in favor of Sue King being special town meeting, meeting clerk, please say aye. 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 Motion passes. Marina, if you could read the warning and notice. Warning and notice, Town of Watertown, Connecticut, special town meeting, August 21st, 2023. The legal voters of the Town of Watertown and those entitled to vote in the town meeting are hereby warned and notified of a special town meeting to authorize an appropriation in the amount of $310,136.10 from the general fund for the Board of Education Security Communication Project. A steep grant has been awarded for the project in the amount of $310,136.27. Of which 248,109 and 10 cents will be reimbursed through the grant, and 62,027 dollars and seven cents will be paid by the town of Watertown as our match. A link to view the special town meeting will be posted on the town of Watertown website www.watertownct.org by 4 p.m. on the day of the meeting. Those eligible to vote at the special town meeting must attend in person. Anyone wishing to provide comments for the meeting may do so by emailing towncouncil at watertownct.org or by mail to Watertown Town Council, 61 Echo Lake Road, Watertown, 06795, and must be received by 2 p.m. on August 21st, 2023. If you require a translator or accommodation for hearing impairment or other accommodation, please contact the Town of Watertown at 860-945-5255. Dated at Watertown, Connecticut, the 14th day of August, 2023. Thank you. And is there a motion? I'll make, I'll make a motion to authorize the appropriation in the amount of $310,136.10 from the general fund for the Board of Education Security, School Security Communication Project. The steep grant has been awarded for the project in the amount of $310,136.27, of which $248,109.10 will be reimbursed through the grant, and $62,027.07 as the town of Watertown's match. Is there a second? Second. Mark, would you like to give a brief description? Or Board of Ed. Oh, no, we're in Board of Ed. For a little bit. That's for a little bit. <laughs> My mistake, sorry. So, yes, uh, this is a steep grant that we applied for in 2021. Um, we're just getting the paperwork up and running through the state. So, basically, this is uh, allowing us to install a system in the schools. Uh, this will include our um, parochial schools as well. And basically, it's an auditory coordinated effort. In case we were to have an intruder, we'd have a direct connection to the police department. Um, it will allow for visually impaired and auditory impaired students to get the alert. Additionally, as this uh, system could be expanded to actually include the police department to interact with the cameras uh, upon response. So again, it was uh, the uh, approximately the 260,000 with the $60,000 match will get us uh, up and running with that system. Thank you. Is there anyone from the public that has any comments on this project? Seeing none, is there anyone in the town council that would make any comments or questions? I just have one question. Gary? <clears throat> now, I know we're, we're um, part of the grant is to support the two parochial schools. Do we get anything back in return? With the, you know, we get, you know, further, or is this like a federally from the parochial schools themselves? Yeah. 
it's not. It was um, when we went through this process applying for the steep grant, that was the intention for us to ensure that we took care of our parochial schools without any cost to them. Okay. It's strictly a safety, a really a safety improvement. <clears throat> I have a question. Is there any potential for the town to also hook into the grant down the road? I mean, to hook into the system for security with cameras and whatever? We can... Um, in other words, if we wanted to put one in town hall and <coughs> one at the fire department or one at water and sewer. Interconnect all the systems. Right. Is uh, it possible for town buildings somewhere down the road to become part of that system? Yes, it would be an additional, an additional equipment cost. so that the police department could um, dial in, so to speak, and get into our camera systems, yes. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Another yeah, one more. Um, is this the same system that uh, Waterbury has just installed so they could connect? It's different. Um, this is more of the alarm and alert system. It, it's a coordinate alert system, so it's kind of compared to the fire alarm system where if there were a fire in the building, you pull the fire alarm and it activates everything. This will be a uh, intruder alert or emergency alert. Um, a team member can pull the alert. It would generally activate the police department. It would be an automatic phone call to the police department, which you know stops all that uh, downtime for people trying to make the decision on when to call and why to call. Well, you make a feed from the school for the intruder where it occurs. Will that not only be showing up at police communications, but in the responding cruisers? It has the potential to actually be on the uh, responding cruisers um, CAD system. Um, at this point, all the um, pieces will not be in place for that, but once we get the, the basics in, that's something we could work towards, which, as you're aware, it's very important for our police officers to understand what they're going into. Is Thank this you. a system called Mutual Link? Luigi, do you remember the name of this? Lens, lens program. Lens, program. lens program. Lockdown emergency notification system. Okay, thank you. Correct, that's Luigi Filardo. <laughs> Any other questions or comments? Seeing none, all in favor, please say aye. 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 Opposed? Aye. Motion passes. Motion to adjourn. So, so moved. Thank you. Sorry. <laughs> Recording stopped. I want to ask them if they have the actual cards.